Hey guys! So, today our video is about habits. So, what is your worst habit and what would you like to change? Think about that and let me know. You can share your comments, you can send me an email and whatever. Yeah, just share your message out there. So, we all have some habits that we don't really like. All right. So for me, for example, years ago, I used to be a very heavy smoker and I was like one day, I think I was uh, 29 age. Yeah. A few years ago. <laughs> and I was, you know, I was going up the stairs and I was feeling like <clears throat> I couldn't breathe. That day I said, hold on. That cannot be my life. I, can't, I don't want this. This is not me. So I didn't like myself being like so, and I, I didn't feel healthy. And I, I said, I don't want this anymore. So it was a very bad habit. And I tried to, it wasn't easy. Ex uh, smokers, I'm sure that you, you, you feel me, right? Uh, it's not that easy. But what did I did? Because human beings, by nature, we are like, we, we react. If, if someone says to you, you can't do that, probably you will do that. And so I know because I'm like that myself. So I, I said to myself, if, if I said to Nadia, you can't smoke again, I know that I will smoke again at some point. So I was thinking, what can I do in order to help me to stop to quit smoking? And I created a new lifestyle. I didn't quit smoking, but at the same time, parallel and the same time I started a new lifestyle which was I start running I start eating healthier and I start exercising not much because I'm not fan of the gym so but then I wasn't boxing so I just um I, I was running actually and doing you know some workout at home and all that so because I was running all that I didn't I didn't have much my cardio was a mess due to smoking so I thought okay I will smoke less in order to run faster or to to you know to improve my cardio and that slowly slowly helped me to to quit smoking because one day I said you know what I reduce smoking so much I think I can do it yeah I can so what did I do so one way that I'm sharing now with you is like we can replace bad habits by creating the lifestyle that you 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 <laughs> uh, yeah by creating a lifestyle that suits you because we change i mean when i was young i thought that smoking was cool and all that you know and uh, back in the day wearing uh, levi's and uh, smoking marlboro whatever it was cool but now not now i mean back then i was nearly the age of 30 when i quit smoking i realized that smoking is it's just you you are inhaling like smoke into your lungs so we grow we change and our lifestyle can change too it doesn't mean that because you you had a lifestyle for how how many years that doesn't mean that you 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 know you have to maintain the same lifestyle forever so do me this favor think what kind of um think what kind of um not kind wrong word think the habits that you have that you don't like think why you don't like them for example i don't like my bad habit now is that i eat too much crisps and it's not good for me it's not good for my body not about calories and all that it's not good for my stomach sometimes it makes me sick and i don't like that feeling who likes the feeling of feeling sick right so i'm trying to moderate that again by creating new habits or by putting limits for example i said to myself that your cheat day is friday and sunday depending on how addicted you are because it's a kind of addiction actually for example me i am addicted to crisps well it sounds stupid but i am and nuts and peanut butter well i have few addictions um but it depends if those addictions they you know they're harming you they are okay with you they are you are feeling good with your body the most important thing in life no matter what i say or whoever says the most important thing in life is you to feel good with yourself 
it's you to feel good with your body it's you to feel strong and healthy and yeah that that's the most important thing in life nothing else because if you don't feel strong if you don't feel healthy you won't have strength you won't have this motivation to wake up in the morning and go after the world and chase your dreams and succeed your goals so think of that so habit it's a very important thing because it's a habit to wake up in the morning think about it it's a habit so it's a habit to brush your teeth habit to have coffee for example if you have coffee or juice we have so many habits in life so choose carefully your good habit that will replace your bad habit but if you are a very reactive person like i am then maybe you shouldn't say to yourself you won't eat that again or you won't do that again try to create the lifestyle that you want yourself to have and then based on the new lifestyle i guarantee you that you will create good habits and your bad habits will slowly slowly go away guarantee i'm telling you yeah so share your comments and so what is your worst habit? Thank you guys.